So, hi dear Sagittarius, a very very good evening to you guys. This is Anjali Taro and this is a journal of reading for all the Sagittarius Sun, Moon, Venus rising. Keep in mind this is general, it might or might not resonate with you at the first place. The second thing, the rules can be reversed also. Third thing, this is a reading from 26th of Feb till the 3rd of March. And this is valid for every 12 sign that you are dealing with along with your own sign. Meaning if you are dealing with another uh, score, uh, Sagittarius, then also it's valid for you, right? So let's start. If you want to be a professional tarot card reader like me, you can start your journey by purchasing my course. The link is in the description box for the same. It's in simple plain English language with lifetime access and certification. If you want to start your self-love journey but don't know from where to start, you can definitely start by purchasing my ebook and workbook. Again, it's super easy to understand, loaded with a lot of information and it's super affordable too. So let's start, Sagis. Your person or your partner's current feelings for you right now at this present moment? The hermit, someone is giving you the silent treatment, okay. Or someone might be thinking a lot about the future direction of the situation, but not saying anything to you about it. Let's clarify the hermit. Wow. We have the strength card, the three of swords, the star card. This is someone who is trying to heal themselves from a heartbreak that they are encountering. I don't know if it's related to you or something else. This person is going through a lot of pain right now in their life and uh, uh, the situation is that they are trying their best to heal themselves without involving you in their healing journey because they feel like right now isolating themselves and taking a break from you or from the situation is the right thing to do. Now we have three major arcana card on the table so it means something major is going on in their life that's hurting them that's kind of uh, very difficult to deal with for them so that is why this person is kind of trying to heal themselves by focusing every like by, by focusing all of their energy uh, on themselves and uh, within themselves like going inside of them and taking a break from everything and everyone trying to figure out a way to get out of the situation and be happy again so you could be dealing with the aquarius leo libra or again leo again so it's like a major arcana energies i'm reading like major arcana signs it's not uh, important, it's not mandatory, but might be you're dealing with this, these signs. Let's see, what do you feel about this particular person or situation? Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising, of course. Knight of Swords. Okay, you feel like running away from the situation as far as you can because you can't deal with the situation or there's something that you don't want to deal with. Let's clarify the Knight of Swords. You feel like it's too stressful for you to convert the love that you have for this situation or for this person into something casual because you might be in a very serious kind of energy towards this particular person or situation but because of the stressful energies that this person or this situation is giving you, you feel like running away from the situation completely rather than making it something else that you don't want to make it, right? Okay. So you're, you're in love or you feel uh, or you have lots of emotions attached to this situation. So you can't convert the love into something like uh, just uh, casual or something like uh, that doesn't matter. That's not serious or something like that. That is why you feel like, okay, let's get out of the situation. Let's try to get out of the situation. Let's finish it. Hmm. Okay, let's see what this person wants from you, Sajis. What are their intentions for the situation between you and them? This person wants to put this thing on hold, put this situation on hold. They want time, they want time and space, they want to understand. Okay, let's clarify the two of wands. They might be having other things going on in their life that they want to focus, sorry, focus on right now at this present moment. This person is going through some kind of internal transformation and they don't want to uh, let other people disturb them in that journey, in that transformation, right? Okay, what they want is to move on from the confusion. So that is why they need time and space to understand the reality of the situation between you and them. Whether they want the reconciliation, whether they want this connection to be with you or not, whether they want to move on. So they want to clear their head. See, this, this is a soul connection. It's not one of those connections where like uh, both of you are just uh, with each other just for fun or something. It's a serious deal. At least for one of you, it's a very serious deal. So this person wants to understand the dynamic of the situation between you and them along with this energy of dealing with other things that they are dealing with 
okay now they want this time the space and the energy of letting go of the confusion out of their mind out of their system so that they can make up their mind whether to be with you or not to be with you but they're one uh, like they're sure about one thing that this is something serious for them this is a serious deal for them you guys have a soul connection okay they want to uh, act only when they are going to be super uh, clear about what they really want out of the situation then they want to take the action this is actually a very mature thing to do might be the way they are doing it uh, seems rude to you or might be it's not a, like a, the, the good way that they are doing it but actually it's a very good thing to do let's see what do you want from this particular person or situation from your side sagis the emperor you want a proper decision you want to like make a proper decision and you want to stick to that decision you want honesty you want loyalty and you want a decision a fucking decision out of this because you're kind of done let's clarify the emperor yes you want to get out of this feeling like uh, left out in the cold kind of thing you want to move on from this mental jail you want to move on from the stress and you want a particular decision to be made you want to level up you want to the, take the charge of the situation and then you want to stick to that decision that you are going to make or this person is going to make regarding this particular situation between you and them so you want something solid out of this situation so that you can move on or you can stick around according to the decision okay got it yep so you you just want to keep your energies open your heart open your energies open towards uh, like whatever will come out of the situation at the same time you want a solid the uh, uh like decision to be made whether you are going to do it or the other person or both of you are going to uh, make it but you want to come out of the stressful energy as soon as possible nobody wants to stick around to this kind of energies right so you are also trying to get out of this as soon as possible and make uh, make up your mind and uh, do the right thing okay let's see what's coming towards you till the 3rd of march sage is in the situation we have the page of swords some kind of uh, communication is coming that might hurt you but at the same time it's going to be like something coming out of the situation that you are waiting for let let's clarify the page of swords you might be at a distance from each other some of your distance is the problem or communication is the problem okay let's see the page of swords let's clarify this wow i do see somebody somebody trying to talk to you about the betrayal or de deceptive kind of energies that uh, they did with you or you did with them i don't know what who did what with the with, with whom here but somebody is going to talk about this situation that is kind of deceptive and both of you will try to figure out a way to forgive and forget and move ahead now it could lead to a, a possibly a permanent breakup or it could lead to a, a reconciliation depends on how you are going to react to the situation how you are going to react to the communication because even if you guys are born on the same day even if you all of you are sagittarius born on same day let me tell you one thing your outcome and the other person's outcome can never be the same it's all the play it's all the game of energies i am just telling you the energies that this is the possibility these are the energies available what you going to do about it is completely up to you because you have a consciousness and you have a free will only human species on this planet earth have the consciousness of making decisions so what you going to do about it it's completely up to you honey but i do see a conversation that's going to hurt you might be but at the same time this going this, that that conversation that communication is lead is going to lead to this energy of whether you want to stick around or you want to leave for good this time okay yep so let's see the guidance for you guys sagis in the situation page of cups queen of pentacles the empress yes your honesty can lead to something very magical in the coming future just be honest very very honest about your feelings about what you really want out of a situation and like how you are visualizing a situation in the coming future with this particular person or uh, in general uh, in your love and relationship area your honesty your truthfulness and your own uh, like love towards you can lead to something very magical in the coming future 
but all you have to do be you all you have to do from your side is to be very very honest about your feelings about your energies about your uh, understanding of what you really want out of love and relationship so that you can actually get it in the in the 3d world yeah yeah so thank you so much for tuning in uh, sages i'll see you soon in the next video bye bye take care god bless you namaste